Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is your friend and neighbor, Dr. Jimmy128 Bring to you another video, so if you can, if you, as you can check on my bed, I have my laptop here I have my very messy room all around me, I'm sorry for that But anyway, I'm here to give you a very very special video Today is going to be a feature video And I, I'm going to be featuring something that I got From our friends over at the uh, uh, strategic Technologies Bacala, the SAP, uh, Mike, and everyone else. So this, my friends, is the Thermaltake Esports Dragon Keyboard Bag. Yes! Keyboard Bag. Now, to begin, um, if any of you have been paying attention, you know, to the events that have been going on locally and internationally, gaming is now a growing, a growing culture. Uh, all around the world. I mean, it's basically a lifestyle already or livelihood already in Korea, Europe, and the US are, or in North America, you know, are really getting into it. We already have like, you know, companies sponsoring players and everything. And yeah, that's nice and all, but what about, you know, those people who just like to play games, the casual gamers? So, uh, you know, they, 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 after just like basketball, when they watch their heroes use. Uh, different bags from Nike, Adidas, um, using different shoes and etc. Using different stuff. In the gaming community, people like to buy gaming keyboards, right? In the world of esports, they buy gaming keyboards, gaming mice, gaming headsets. And sometimes, you know, um, people have not really uh, gone into. Uh, you know, they, uh, they haven't really delved into the industry where it can make things convenient for the gamers. I mean, if basketball players have their uh, the, their bags for the, their gym bags, their duffel bags or whatever, um, in, for gamers, um, some companies have already begun, you know, things like this, uh, creating keyboard bags. Uh, one good example is Razer. Another one is SteelSeries. They also have their own version of keyboard bag, a gamer's bag. Uh, TD Esports also have the land bag, which is um, geared towards people who, you know, go to land parties. I actually have a video of that, a very old video where I featured the TT Esports Dragon land bag. Today, this is the TT Esports Dragon keyboard bag. So that's it for my extremely long introduction. So basically, this is a bag that will carry all your peripherals from your keyboards, your mice, your headsets, your mouse pads, and even you know other things that you might need to bring when you're let's say going to a net cafe or going to an event and you need uh, you know a bag to hold things I mean bags like this they are not built to you know, carry keyboards gaming keyboards professional gaming keyboards okay? they will just stick out right and they don't have the proper padding or you know they're not built for that so a couple of companies, TT Sports, Razer, Steel Series, Hub, even Cooler Master or CM Storm have already made their own bags for uh, gamers. So I have here again a keyboard bag. So let us look into it. So let's take a look at the outside of the bag. The front is really nice and a nice black uh, finish. You have the Dragon logo there, which I love. I love the TT Sports Dragon logo. For those of you who don't know, I'm a huge TT Sports fan. Shifting over from my old brand, um, I fell in love. So you did have a zipper here, so maybe you could put stuff here like a uh, mouse pad, because it's basically a flat, you know, a flat pocket. I think it goes all the way down. Yep, it goes all the way down. Oh, oh, what's this? Okay. So we have some stuff in here. I didn't realize that. Okay. Not much, not much to do there. Just the TT Sports tag. So you maybe have a pocket there. Let's look at the back. So we have nice padding so that um, you, you won't feel your peripherals you know, inside. One of the biggest uh, inconveniences when you're using like regular bags, you can feel your keyboard when, you're, when you put your bag on. Okay, the padding here prevents it from happening and it also you know protects the peripherals that you have inside from any shock coming from the outside world. And then it of course has a really nice thick strap. This is you know really uh, nice and secure. Notice the very very thick, the very thick. Uh, what do you call that? Yeah, the 
the threading is really thick so you know this won't no matter how heavy your stuff is you know you won't have to worry about this strap break, this strap breaking off and here you have the rest of the strap you can easily adjust the length and you can also adjust it from the right to left so if you like carrying your bag this way no problem if you like carrying your bag on your right shoulder okay no problem you can even carry the bag like this so that's pretty cool and you even have here um uh nice city sports logo and uh challenge the game oh yeah so let's get inside so uh, the zippers here they have uh, rubber tips so this will prevent this will provide you for easy gripping the zippers so it goes all the way down and then when i open it up it will show various compartments three main compartments so first off you see my TT Sports lay down now span. Woo! One of my favorites. Okay, so then you have different compartments here. You have your compartment for your keyboard. And here you have your compartments for that. So you, here you can put a tablet, whatever you can put your cell phone, your headset, your mice, whatever. So let's see what I have actually packed. Okay. So first, let's look at this pocket. So here I have packed. Logitech webcam, C920 I believe, excellent webcam, An external hard drive, my cell phone, <laughs> and my mouse. This is a TTA Sports Theron, and this has been with me for almost two years now, and it's still perfect. Okay, you can still fit a bunch of stuff there. It even has a strap to secure. On this side, um, I have uh, a case fan. So yeah, you can, I think you know this part is mainly. You can also put it in here. Put your headset in here. Notice there, uh, there is um, there's some slack. So you know it doesn't really remain flat. If you have like thick, if you you can really pack stuff. You can really stuff a lot of things in this pocket. And then here, of course, obviously, gee, I wonder what I could have put here. Hmm. Okay, uh, modular USB cable for my keyboard. And of course, my keyboard. Ooh. So you can basically, you know, if you, if you can imagine using the bag, you know, you, you go to like your Pinoy gaming festivals, your esports festivals, whatever. And yeah, you have you know a very very safe place to put in your stuff. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention more padding inside. Just more very very thick padding to make sure that your peripherals are nice and secure. So I hope you guys enjoyed my little feature presentation of the Thermal Tape Esports uh dragon keyboard bag big shout outs to strategic tech bakala uh, mike and all the other people there um thank you so much for bringing this for you know allowing me to purchase this i've been actually i've been looking for this particular item for about two years and oh, the people over at strategic technologies were able to get this so uh thank you very much to mike and everyone at strategic technologies bakala this has been your friendly neighbor, Dr. Jimmy. Like the video if you liked it, dislike it. If you don't like the video, obviously. In the comments below, do you think, uh, I don't know if you're going to answer this, but do you think, you know, um, companies that sell stuff like this, do you think you know, it'll be viable for them? Because one of the reasons why this isn't available in the Philippines is it really isn't in demand. So do you think, you know, this is a very, this is, a, this is something that you would buy? So that's pretty much it. This is your friendly neighbor, Dr. Jimmy. Thank you for watching. Subscribe. Bye-bye.